Hey everybody, welcome back to another reaction. It's Lance and Dustin for episode two of In Minutes of Shadow. Uh, yeah, so we got the crazy thing that happened in the first episode. And thank you for a lot of the comments you gave us down below. I read them all. And yeah. I was told this is technically a harem, Dustin. So let's see where that goes. And uh, right. yeah, let's dive into this next episode. So you're an heir. Oh, who's not me? Oh, okay. Oh, oh. Sister's better. Got it. Damn, his sister's airs up. <laughs> right? That's a good one, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Trinity background character A. There he is. Oh! <laughs> Damn. So he's 100%. Oh, we got guns. Okay. That cloak. Oh. Jesus Christ. This is bloody. Dang. Uh. Oh. Oh. He said, hang in there. This is this is edgy or Kirito. <laughs> it really is. Or if Kirito would actually be more ooh. He's fine. Just kidding. Slime. Yeah, if Kirito had yeah. more of an ego, that's what Kirito would be. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's got a slime body suit. He experimented a lot. Wow. Oh, did he turn it into a hot girl? Yeah, Probably. he did. The elf. Yeah. There it is. Of course he would turn it into a hot elf girl. Of course. Yeah. Oh, no, no. The, she, that's yeah, what she was she before. Was, okay. Yeah, she was magic overloaded and he got rid of that. That's, yeah. I, it just, it makes sense that she... <laughs> He's trying to like this is my first performance. Let me let me get this right. <laughs> uh naked. Man. <laughs> Dang. She is okay, so she's the, the one that runs the business side of everything. Yeah. Okay. Oh, nice. Is he just going to go through the alphabet as he gains followers? Probably. Pretending. He's got to, though, right? He wants to be in the yeah. shadows. One day he's going to fight his sister for real. Oh, he just thought about that. Yeah, see, it's showing that he yeah. could he could have done it, but he didn't. Yeah. Okay, now I, I want to just. I just want to oh, see. She felt it. Yeah, I just want to see her reaction when he shows like, "No, I'm actually really strong." Yeah, when he shows his true power, I oh, can't wait. I'm not even sure if that's been done in the uh, manga yet or not. Oh, damn. Oh. Hey, water walk, all right. Okay, Nard. Oh, so <laughs> the cult is, is a real thing. All right. Yeah. He is he is basically Eins. He just lucks into this. It's very well done though. The He said, dang it, missed. Yeah, he's just going. Yeah, he's Eins. We, yeah. found, ki we found the kid of Eins, basically. Oh, 
This, this is so much Overlord, and I'm here for it because I love Overlord. Yeah. <laughs> That's just hilarious. <laughs> you deserve an Academy Award. Eins, is that you? No wonder why there was right. an eminence of shadow and like uh, uh, Overlord, like crossover, like art I saw that was really cool looking. Oh, yeah. Oh, so she had signs of possession, but he healed her. That's the rumor. Mm. Uh oh, is she going to be a Brocon? <laughs> oh. Uh, is she is she is she a brocon? God Ooh. damn! <laughs> yeah, I fucked. Yeah, you're done. <laughs> no, that's <laughs> awesome. Oh. <laughs> I like the uniforms. Yeah. Bad then. She's not even messing with him. She's just playing. I mean, it. It. I, I guess it would be fair to say she's probably out of all the girls, at least the strongest, more likely. Her being the first. Yeah. Could be wrong. Uh oh. Demon pills. Oh well. Oh. <laughs> well. I'm. I knew it. <laughs> this is so cool. This is fucking Ides' kid. One hundred percent. It's the one, though. <laughs> wow! <laughs> the ultimate disrespect. <laughs> oh. oh. Your lunge is weak. Let's some one. <laughs> Lesson two. <laughs> Ow. Jesus. Ah, uh, oh. uh, we got a quick backstory of him, real fast. Yeah, he doesn't care. Then I'll dive deeper. That's a cool shot. Yeah, it Ooh, just ate, ate them the all. Thing. Wow. Jesus. That's bright. So and spliced out the middle.
Yeah. Uh, yeah. It was like, come on. Yeah. Yeah. Rip. Yeah. Okay, well, hmm. we'll probably end up seeing Milia later. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we found out she's a Brocon, though, so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's just looking yep. at like a video game. Yep. To go where? What the? Wait, what? Why? What the hell? I wonder if it's to do with what we saw them at the beginning, right? They were like in like other outfits in the daytime, right? Yeah. So maybe they're doing that or maybe they have to go to the Capitol too. I don't know. Well, I guess I'll find out. We'll find out. I'm sure people in the comments will let us know as well, but you don't need to spoil it, obviously. But yeah, so this is just Ainz's kid. No, I'm joking. <laughs> right. Right. But it's everything I love to I like about Overlord, the OPness and lucking into stuff and lucking into things and him just. And like I said, he, it's it's always fun. It, I always do love a good main character that's got an ego and they're just they know they're good. Right. Yeah. I love it. it. To me, it's fun. It's it's also different because you usually have the, the, you know, their whole heart. They're all nice and awesome or something like that. But I just like like them being like egotistical a little bit and just be like, I'm good. And I know I'm good. And so yeah. I like that for that. And him looking into everything just makes it hilarious. I can see why this is really well loved. And like I said earlier, I can see why. There was like a crossover art thing I saw with Eins and, and this dude together, so that just made so much more sense now. Uh, I'm, yeah. calling, I'm calling him Eins's kid. Eins is an Abedo's kid. Uh, yeah. I'm curious if we're ever going to get any of like, was he summoned there for a reason? I don't think he was. I think it just happenstance, but we'll see. Yeah. Um, this felt like the true first episode, and somebody had told me that the first episode we got was actually like volume in volume four, just to give more backstory. I understand why they oh, had that fair. as the first episode to get what his he's all about. Mm -hmm. um, but this really felt like the true first episode where we're getting what he wants to do and we're collecting his, his not harem because I've been told it's not a harem. And it is funny if he is going to go down the alphabet, alphabet, uh, Bravo, like <laughs> Charlie, Delta, Echo, all that stuff. It'd be hilarious. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, it's a good, it's a fun show so far. Uh, I need, I need an overarching, more of an overarching plot. Like I said, we don't get a lot of brocon stuff, so that's always fun too. So it's gonna be mm -hmm. interesting more with the sister once we get him into this the capital school and everything too. So, but yeah, I think it's a good, it's a good ride. What about you? Yeah, I mean, I like it. I I would like more to go into like how the magic works. Mm -hmm. It's a little kind of it's it's kind of op for like everyone. It seems like unlimited because there's not really like like a visible limit on like what magic can and cannot be used. Yeah, because like he's been using basically everything under the sun like enchantment fucking like empower things and, and yeah. like walking on water yeah and that's but, a part of world building so hopefully we get more of an answer yeah. to that and if we don't it is what it is but I, we prefer yeah. it too right i mean the good isekais really do that well i mean you know the power scaling in Mushoku tensei you even know how that works in Mushoku tensei you mm -hmm. kind of know how it works in overlord because it's based on spells that they learned from the previous game so you yeah. kind of understand that magic system. So yeah, I, I totally get what you're getting. So maybe we'll get that. And, you know, commenters yeah. can let us know down below if, if, if they will eventually get to that or they won't. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, but like, comment, share, subscribe. And uh, as always, we'll catch you for the reaction sometime soon. Deuces.